You will need 0 to 500 pounds of fresh raw walnuts, 5 cups of spring water, blender, mesh cloth, and a bowl. Adding in your water, fresh raw walnuts, and we will blend on the smoothie option. While stewing this walnut milk, walnuts are meatier than almonds, which means it doesn't need much straining using this recipe. But if you want, feel free to use 0 to 300 pounds. But for me, I like my milk to be potent. So we only need to remove a little bit of foam here, and we're going to strain the walnut milk please i repeat do not be like me i poured the entire walnut into the mesh strainer and honestly i was only supposed to pour little by little but this is my first time making walnut milk so rather than not posting the video i still posted it with my faults so yeah put little by little and because i felt like i was milking a cow so yes lesson learned <laughs> But I still decided to post. So by my fault, you should actually win making this walnut milk. Because this showed you here what not to do, right? Okay, let's continue. So I'm pressing down gently because I already made a boo-boo by pouring all the walnut milk. So yeah, the walnut milk is coming out just a little slower. We see here that is not a lot of pulp in this recipe. It's not much foam to be honest, but I'm just removing what I see. Mm -mm. You can look at that milk and see that rich. Let's see how much we got from this recipe. We got five cups. So we're gonna pour them into two 12 ounce jars and we have a little bit left over. These guys, if you do not have a Vitamix blender, feel free to use whichever blender that you have. It should work. And I decided to store my milk in glass jars. But whatever you have, just make sure that the lid is sealable and also the refrigerator is cold enough to keep the milk. 